Often coaches are asked with the question of should my girl play on an all-girls team, she's currently on a boys team, or when does that switch happen, right? And um, I'll be honest with you, I'm a firm believer everyone's path is different. I think that there are girls that are physically capable of playing boys, and I've known some that do play boys their whole life, and that's okay. I think there's also situations where a girl may be stepping on the ice, and I think we're so narrowed in on the physicality of it that we don't really take into consideration the socialization factor, the mental factor of it. I think as soon as a girl steps on the ice with boys and is so concerned about the physicality that mentally she's not playing hockey, she's not focusing on development, she's not having fun, that's the time to kind of step back and say, you know, what do you want to do? And I encourage highly that the player is asked that because I've had parents come up to me where they they want their daughter to play girls, you know, concerned about safety, everything like that. But when you go up and ask a girl, she wants to stay on the boys team. Or you go up and ask a girl and she's like, yes, I want to play on an all-girls team, right? So every person's situation is different. And in some areas of our country, that's all we have, right? As far as girls' programs may be a far distance. So there's a lot of questions that go into that answer. And I, I'm a firm believer that everyone's is different.